struggling to get good seats ahead of Monday's eclipse. And even though we won't be in the total path of totality, we will be in the path to see at least some of it. Thank goodness with what we could <laughs> see. Here's meteorologist David Keller. David, I was so scared we wouldn't see anything. So some good news here. At yeah, least. we will see at least part of that eclipse. Of course, the best part is always going to be that path of totality that stretches from southwest Texas through Arkansas, Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, up into New York. That is going to be the absolutely most spectacular part of this eclipse. Now here in Nebraska and Iowa, we're going to see between about 60 and 80 percent coverage of the sun. The, the sky may dim a little bit, but it's not going to be exceptionally noticeable unless you're actually viewing the eclipse. So you can see right through Omaha about 80% coverage. The eclipse that'll start just afternoon on Monday. Maximum eclipse. That's when the moon is covering the most of the sun will be right at 155 in the afternoon. We may have some clouds to deal with, but I think we'll still have a decent view. Temperatures a little chilly during the morning. We'll get into the 50s by the afternoon, so I think it's going to be a nice day to view that eclipse here in Omaha. The partial eclipse here in town will then end just after 3 o'clock. Here's the forecast. You can see there may be some clouds in the morning, but perhaps some clearing just in time for that maximum eclipse happening at 155 in the afternoon. Now, a couple of things to remember if you're going to try to watch this eclipse. It's never safe to look directly at the sun, no matter what part of the eclipse it is, unless you're in totality. We will not have that here in Omaha, so you must use those eclipse glasses or use some other indirect viewing methods like a, a pinhole shoebox or check out the shadows that trees cast. You may see the shape of the eclipse in the shadows. If you are getting those glasses, make sure they are ISO certified, not sunglasses. Make sure they have that little logo on the side there. That means they are safe to use for the eclipse. Aaron Jacklin. Great advice there, David. Thank you very much. Excited for this. Yeah, no, good news to know, especially. Should still